My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. This is really one of the coolest cars I think they ever made. This interior is so cool. Swivel seats, bucket seats all around, console front to back, push button starter. Uh, it, the list goes on and on. Big cross ram under the hood, tail fins. This car is cool. I can't wait to tell you all about it. But you can go to volocars.com. That's where you can read all the specs, study all the pictures top to bottom. That's where you find the price tags on over 200 cars. And I probably should tell you, it is a 1961 Chrysler 300G letter car. That's their high-performance luxury car. Only 1,280 of these were made, and they say only about 20% had air conditioning, which this one does. Uh, and if you enjoy our video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on the bell icon, you'll be notified as the new videos are posted. Right now, join me, let's go for a spin. So underneath the car looks to be rock solid, original. It's not been apart, not been restored, but very respectable, original, uh, good shape. The dual exhaust system does look to be pretty recent. Uh, it's a Southern car. We got it from Louisiana. Uh, the guy owned it the last 10 years. Uh, so it is really solid. This big long body and it's black, shows everything, is straight as an arrow. I mean, this thing is laser beam. It's like a mirror. Look at the trunk lid with the uh, you know, louvers, or not louvers, but uh, the lines on the trunk lid. This really cool emblem, and this actually serves as a little handle to open and close the trunk. Look at these tail fins. Reverse lights are built in them. Tail lights are down here. They're very pointed fins. The stainless trim, the red, white, and blue 300. Matches in the middle of the hubcap. You got a little red, beautiful hubcap, radial white wall tires. Look at the big window and the sloping roof line. Real nice glass, got a few minor imperfections. Got a really cool mirror, cool door handles you lift up. This paint is slick. I mean, it's like a mirror. And it is born a black car, I just checked tag is right here is paint code B for black. Formal black, they call it. Uh, stacked headlights, they call that, it's canted. And the, look how the grill, the bumper, all of that matches. You got that red, white, and blue. All the chrome up here is beautiful. Everything's sparkling, shiny. The uh, marker lights. This side's just as straight. Now I'm looking across that giant Hood. You can make three refrigerators out of that hood, and it is straight and smooth. This is straight and smooth. I didn't find any bubbles, no cracking. Uh, this is in really nice shape. You can kind of tell I'm enthusiastic about it. Look at that big rear window. So here we go. This is where it gets even cooler. Swivel seats. Why did they stop making that? That's the coolest thing. But it's a console that goes front to back, has the armrest cushion, compartments that open front and back, has a tachometer, because this is a muscle car, uh, the power window switches. And this is all leather. You got four leather bucket seats in there, true bucket seats, front and back. This seat also swivels and it's power. And I just noticed it has a rear window uh, defroster. And again, leather, soft leather is probably the original. It's, it's not uh, it's soft. It's not cracked or torn, but it's just got the little patina, like a perfect leather jacket. Door panels are mint. The headliner has chrome ribs. It's in excellent shape. The visors are excellent. The dash. Look at our pictures at how the dash pod lights up. Uh, they call it the Astrodome or something like that. There's a name for it. I think it's the Astrodome and it has some special luminescent lighting uh, and it all lights up nice. Push button transmission. You hit the buttons. On the other side is the push buttons for the air. They match. They all light up. Clear plastic steering wheel. 
Uh, no cracks in it. It's a beautiful steering wheel. There's just so many cool features I like about the car. That's why I'm saying I think it's the coolest car ever built. I mean, how many trunks have the ribs? That's the word I was looking for, is the ribs and the trunk. Just the features are just endless. And the trunk is huge. This is a functional handle. <laughs> you don't realize it until you go to use it. Uh, beautiful in here. It's all carpeted, has the cardboard filler panels, uh, radial white wall tire spare. Looks like it's never been used. The weather strips are nice and soft. Yeah, do go and check out our pictures of the dash all lit up, though. Now that I'm saying that, I better make sure the photographer knows to take those. Even the air conditioning vents on the dash, you can turn them, they pop up like clamshells, or you can fold them down flat too. The dash pad's real nice, padded dash, no cracks or splits. And then here we go, the good stuff just keeps on coming. This is a Fort 13 wedge motor, 375 horsepower, 495 pounds of torque. They have a hotter cam, they have bigger valves. They have a forged uh, steel crankshaft, but up on top, you got the two big aluminum cross rams with a four barrel Carter carb hanging off each one of them. So it has eight barrels on there. But when, when do you ever see a setup like that? You got air conditioning, power steering, power brakes. Uh, the firewall air box is nice raw fiberglass. You got the washer fluid bag. You got both horns. Batteries bolted down. Uh, it's got the R134 Freon. This is not a body off nut and bolt restored car, but it's a really nice car. Everything in here looks really good and proper. And this body is amazing. There's nothing you have to do to this body. It is polished, straight, shiny. Door jams are slick. Weather strips are real nice. It even has the metal, uh, metal trim on the carpet. Uh, it has sewn in uh, floor mats, heel pads on the other side, metal ones. It's just a high-end uh, luxury car with a big old performance motor. And it's got style. That door closed nice. Here's that little handle I like. And the color, formal black with the tan beige leather interior. The back seats are in mint condition. That I can just go on and on, but my time is probably up. Go to volocars.com. I just gave you my impression of this car. Uh, but you go to volocars.com. Plenty of ways to reach out to the salesman. It's got hood insulation. The hinges are clean. If you have specific questions or concerns, feel free to ask them. They'll help you the best they can. And they can also get this big one delivered to your driveway. It's up to you whether you can fit it in your garage or not and then you get your financed as well. If you enjoy the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on the bell icon, you'll be notified when the next video is posted. Thanks for watching.